Not too long ago personal vertical takeoff and landing vehicles were just dreamed that we saw in movies. But today in 2021 and beyond, this dream is no longer just a dream. Recently it has become a reality when a number of innovative group of engineers, inventors, and companies began to announce the development and capabilities of their products, the so-called flying cars, that could actually fly as our personal air vehicles. It is now going to be possible to step into a small personal air vehicle that can actually take off vertically, then start making a transition to horizontal flight and fly at a cruising speed of 280 km per hour and then land 250 km away from takeoff site by making another transition from horizontal flight to a stable and safe vertical flight landing. Such is the capabilities of the Lilium jet, built by a young German company, Lilium GmbH which was founded in 2015 by four engineers and PhD students at the Technical University of Munich, Daniel Wiegand, Sebastian Born, Matthias Miner and Patrick Nathan. Lilium associate themselves with building small personal vertical takeoff and landing vehicles which some people would call them flying cars. This company aims at building radically better ways of moving and become a leader in sustainable high-speed regional air mobility. Here are the milestones, achievements of their products in the last few years. The Lilium Jet is an electric vertical takeoff and landing, or EVTOL, designed and manufactured near Munich, Germany. The jet uses swiveling duct fans to provide vertical thrust for takeoff and landing. These same fans then slowly rotate towards rear facing as the jet accelerates and converts to its forward flight mode. This is flights of the Lilium flying vehicles. Lilium was able to launch a first half-scale demonstrator, Falcon, which flew in 2015. Then on April 20, 2017 Lilium flew an unmanned first flight of the two-seat Eagle full-size prototype at the Mindelheim Matzies airfield, Bavaria, Germany. The air vehicle had a reported maximum speed of 400 km per hour, cruising speed of 300 km per hour, and the range of 300 km. The five-seat prototype unmanned Lilium jet, Phoenix, was flight-tested at Oberpfaffenhofen airfield near Munich. It first flew in May 2019. By October 2019, after 100 flights, 
it could transition from vertical to horizontal flight, reaching over 100 km per hour, but not yet fully horizontal. If on schedule, Lilium's new seven-seat electric jet will be flying across Florida by 2024. Lilium says it will introduce its urban air mobility service in 2025. 14 dedicated verdiports spanning Florida are planned, with service introduction in 2024. So not only will the EVTOL be flying commercially in three years, the company is also building a network of 14 verticports across Florida. The Lilium jet will be the primary aircraft in the network of 14 verticports in Florida with Orlando serving as its headquarters that could be operational in three years. Lilium is also in advanced discussions with partners for 10 vertiports in a European network. While other air taxi service providers focus on urban mobility, Lilium plans to cover longer distances. The new jet has a top speed of 280 km per hour. Its maximum range of more than 250 kilometers will allow for multiple flights of at least 50 kilometers. Unlike other urban air taxi companies, Lilium aims for regional transport routes around the 300 kilometers distance. By 2025, for example, the company wants to connect Orlando with Miami in the south and Jacksonville in the north of Florida. Ticket prices for clients will be similar to other high-end modes of transport, says the company, but costs will go down as passenger volumes increase. We will follow their progress to see if Lilium will finally have the right stuff and be the successful leader in sustainable high-speed regional air mobility. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy this video, please like, share, and subscribe.